There are two kinds of people in this world, the ones who think they can and the ones who think they can't, and they're both right. Thoughts, like beliefs and ideas, make up a part of what I perceive myself as. These are things that I may not even act upon, like how I don't believe in a god in the sky, but when something bad keeps happening, I ask, God, what have I done for you to punish me? So, this is the part of me that could be the most delusional, but there is no action without a thought. And here's mine. I think I can change people's lives with what I do, even if almost nobody watches my art, I still think I can make it and have fun creating. I try to appreciate what I have, because I never know when I might lose it. There is no love without loyalty, and there is no loyalty without love, so a given word to me has to be unbreakable. For me, cheating isn't an option. Freedom of ideas and words is as important, if not more, than physical freedom. If you can't express yourself, then you are bound to be controlled. Everyone should have the right to be heard, even if you're the most deplorable, hateful human being, because we can't expect people to change if we shut them down. It really takes a whole village to raise a child, and kids are actually pretty cool. I might want one. so. I should start thinking of creating a better community for my offsprings. Anything that is not growing is dead, so we better be changing. It's one of the best parts of living. It's better to strive for an unreachable goal and fail than something realistic and succeed. We should be pushing limits of what it means to be a human. Our shells and possessions represent who we are. Man-made mind-altering substances won't ever reach my body because I don't trust someone who is trying to take over my control. People are inherently just animals. Not good, not bad. We just want to survive and enjoy life. Other than that, it's not for us individuals to decide. If I tackle the world more like an RPG game, I would have so much more fun and open opportunities. I'm starting to believe in the concept of God, not just believing in humans and what we can do, but that we all serve a higher purpose, like a bunch of bacteria and microbes in our organism, we are all connected and our goal is to make this life and this place we live in a real utopia. All I can say is that people are walking contradictions, so existence could be beautiful or it could be ugly, but that's on you.